All right, this one's called The Evolution of Teaching Math. This one's kind of clever. <laughs> All right, teaching math in 1950. A logger sells a truckload of lumber for $100. His cost of production is four-fifths of the price. What is his profit? Teaching math in 1960. A logger sells a truckload of lumber for $100. His cost of production is four-fifths of the price, or $80. What is his profit? Teaching math in 1970. A logger sells a truckload of lumber for $100. His cost of production is $80. Did he make a profit? Teaching math in 1980. A logger sells a truckload of lumber for $100. His cost of production is $80 and his profit is $20. Your assignment, underline the number 20. Teaching math in 1990. A logger cuts down a beautiful forest because he is... <laughs> Excuse me. A logger cuts down a beautiful forest because he is selfish and inconsiderate and cares nothing for the habitat of animals or the preservation of our woodlands. <laughs> he does this so he can make a profit of $20. What do you think of this way of making a living? Topic for class participation after answering the question, how did the birds and, <laughs> how did the birds and squirrels feel as the logger cut down their homes? In parentheses, it's kind of visual. It's almost funny when you read it, but there are no wrong answers in parentheses. Now, teaching math in 2010. Una chero vende una caretada de madera por cientos dólares. Ciento. El costo de la producción es ochenta dólares. Sígame los buenos. <laughs> oh, Jesus, that is funny. Oh, Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. It's from my amiga Silvia. Oh, that's good. <laughs>